Hey everyone, today I'm going to be using some fun products from the May 2020 release from iCrafter. So I have the Cosmic Flare stencil, the Elephant Family and Phrase stamp set, and then I'm also going to be using a die from the Happy Birthday Wiper insert die set. So let's start off with this Cosmic Flare stencil. I sprayed the back of it with some pixie spray and I adhered it onto an A2 sized card front. I'm going to use some lemon drop ink, and this is from iCrafter. It's a super bright, fun, happy yellow color. I'm just going to blend this all over the front of this stencil, and I'm keeping the ink darker towards the center of this flare, and then kind of blending it out so it's lighter at the edges of the rays. Once I'm done, I'm going to remove that stencil, and you're going to see there's a fun pattern. See how it's kind of um, skinnier at the top and then wider at the bottom. What I'm going to do is flip this stencil around, position it over the top again, and then I'm going to use that same lemon drop ink and blend over this again. But what's fun is you could use a different color ink and you'll get a tone on tone um, kind of design here. So see how I have the darker lemon drop centers coming down and the lighter ones in the back. It's such a fun stencil. I made a little blip there with my ink blending. I must have picked up some darker ink somehow on my blending brush, so I will go back later and I'll show you how I ended up fixing that. For now though, I have stamped out the elephant from the Elephant Family and Phrases stamp set, and I'm just going to color him with some warm gray markers. Really easy coloring. I started with W0 and just laid down a, a layer of that ink. Now I'm going to come in with W2 as my darker color and just add some shading here and there. Like I said, really simple, nothing too crazy. And then I'll take that W0 and just blend that out again. And I'll use my scissors to fussy cut around that image, leaving a small white border. So like I said, I had that little blip on my background. I grabbed the comic half tone dots stamp set and I'm going to take this oval shaped stamp and put that right in the middle of my card front. I decided to use it more horizontally rather than vertically. And then I'm just going to stamp some, um, some more hybrid ink on top of this. So I have the green apple or the sparkling apple ink from iCrafter. It's a lighter ink and it didn't really work that well on my card. So I'm going to go in with the backyard grass. And this is a darker green ink. I liked that ink color a lot better. I'll end up stamping that two or three times just so that it'll layer up nicely on top of that solar flare stenciled or cosmic flare stenciled background. And then my background will be all fixed and you won't be able to see where I messed up. So this is the happy birthday wiper die set. And all I'm using today is that sentiment. So I die cut the background from white and the actual sentiment itself from black and layered that up, added everything onto the front of my card with some foam adhesive and added some glitter. And this card is finished. It's a really simple, kind of cute little boy style birthday card. Thank you guys so much for joining me. I'll see you again soon. Bye.